I'm often looking for historical images of locations to understand when some change was made. I'm a transportation researcher, so often this relates to when some project was constructed or completed or when some change was made on a road. And Google Maps has a, an excellent tool for helping us at least narrow down the time frame when something may have happened. So what we're going to do is just start in Google Maps, open up google.com slash maps. And what we're going to need to be in is Street View. So we're going to choose this little person down here where it says Browse Street View Images. Then we're going to drag it anywhere where there's a blue line means there's some historical images we can look at. So I'm going to drop it uh, in this location. In particular, I'm going to look here. And this is near NC State University's campus. There's a roundabout here. Maybe you want to get a little bit closer to it. And up in the upper left, we're going to see this image is from June 2022. And we're going to see this button for see more dates. And so just clicking on that and at the bottom of the screen, it's going to open up a timeline that we can see so we can go back in time. And just kind of skimming these images, I can see that it's it's still a roundabout in all of these. I'm going back now towards the to the beginning of this. I'm going to click the oldest one, September. 2007, and I can see this is no longer a roundabout at this point. It's a signalized intersection. I can go to the next available one, which is May 2009, and there may be large gaps in the images that you're able to see, and that's just we have what we have, and hopefully it'll help you in your, your task of narrowing down when something may have happened, but it's not going to be extremely precise down to a day. Uh, it's going to be more from, from year to year. And we can see now it looks like they were setting up for construction of the roundabout at this time period. So it was still an intersection in May 2009. By July 2013, it was a full roundabout. So somewhere in that time frame of 2009 to 2013 is when the roundabout was installed. And just looking at the construction, it looks like it was the construction was starting in this May 20, 2009 time period. So again, a great tool. The Amount of historical data is going to vary by the location. Some may not have this historical set of images, but it can be really helpful in a lot of instances, particularly as you are looking for things that happen more and more recently. You can see the, the resolution has really increased over time for the number of images you can look through.